What is going on everyone, welcome back to another episode of the FIFA 14 Gillingham FC career mode. Now we have a game against uh, Coventry coming up in the league, so hopefully we can uh, pick up three points then. Um, there is one quick thing that I do want to say though, if you, if you play Ultimate Team and you uh, want some Ultimate Team coins, then click link in the description to vbarrack.com, uh, very cheap and reliable. So let's go ahead and head into this Coventry game. Alright, so into the game we go. We are away in this game, so if we could pick up three points here, this would be fantastic. Um, our team is obviously really strong. I did make a couple of changes, first of all, because um, Gregory was injured, so I had to bring Linganzi on. Um, and also, I bring Dak on as well, um, rather than uh, Weston. And then I put uh, Yanazai in left. And then Dak on the right as well, because Dak's been playing really, really well lately. So I wanted to give him a tie, uh, give him a try in the, in the team. And he's also a better rating than Wiles Weston, so why not? But anyway, let's go ahead and get into this game. Hopefully we can pick up the three points. Oh, Ross Barkley. Can he get to that? No, he can't. Oh, that was unlucky. Ross Barkley with an amazing opportunity there. That was a really nice play from first, from the... Uh, kickoff there that was actually really nice so sorry I didn't actually commentate over that but hopefully we can have a little bit more um, of play like that and hopefully pick up a goal from it oh we got the interception we find Yanazai Yanazai finds Dak come on Dak give me another good game oh just couldn't quite get to it the keeper clears it can we get anything from this header it forward maybe find Linganzi to Barkley anything Yanazai gets past his man Finds Ross Barkley. What a ball. Ross Barkley has a shot. Good save from the keeper. It's now corner though, so hopefully we can have something from this. I wanted to go from the far post for Ross Barkley, but that was his weak foot. So it was a good effort from his weak foot. Um, it looked like it was always going high, but that was good. It was good. All right, so Ross Barkley's taking this. Um, let's bring Yanazai. Let's put Yanazai onto this. He's also left-footed, so it kind of suits him a little bit more. But Yanazai takes it, tries to find Ledge. Ledge with a poor header. Finds Barkley. Who finds... Who was that? I don't even know that was. Martin. Okay, Joe Martin left back. But nothing comes of it, sadly. Um, so, yeah. Pretty poor. Oh, it's Connor Wickham. Connor Wickham's on a run. What can Connor Wickham do here? No, nope, that was a poor shot. What the hell was that? Connor Wickham. What the hell was that? What's with that shot? He finds Connor Wickham. Connor Wickham tries to find Barkley. Can Barkley get to that? Can he outpace Clark? He can. And he keeps going. Crosses it in. Who's that? Oh, what a diving header from... I think that is Wickham. But um, defender saved it. I reckon that would have went straight to the keeper anyway. But it was worth an effort, you know. All right, so Connor Wickham, I'm not going to get you to take this. Yanis, I can take it. Let's cross it in. Uh, Finding ledge there. Oh, that would have been good. That was quite a good corner, actually. Connor Wickham. Falls to Connor Wickham. He shoots. And it's a goal. Connor Wickham from outside the box. A little dinky goal, to be honest. It wasn't even the best of goals. But whatever. It's 1-0. Just going into half time. What a lovely little finish that was. It was just a P roller across the floor, but the bounce just before the keeper, I think, put him off a little bit. You see it in a sec. Look, he goes bang. And just that little bounce there puts the keeper off, I think. Um, and puts us up 1 0 as well. That was a lovely little little hit. Just that little bounce puts off the keeper and uh, puts us 1 0 up as well. Alright, so going into half time. 1 0 up, thanks to Connor Wickham. Um, who I said has actually had a poor game pretty uh, the past couple of games. He's not really contributed other than goals. Now, obviously, for a striker, that's all you really want. But, obviously, most strikers as well, they contribute passing. They contribute with, like, crossing in, stuff like that. But Conor Wickham really hasn't done that for me. Every time he gets the ball, he either loses it or passes it badly, like, to the opposition. So, I don't know. It's just not on. I think that, um, hopefully... He can get another one. Hopefully in the second half he'll step up. Otherwise I might have to bring Martial on and uh, give him a little bit of a go. But there you go. There's the half-time scores. And uh, let's get into the second half. Oh, that was not foul. I didn't even touch him. I didn't even touch him. Oh, okay. Yeah, that was quite a bad. Quite a bad challenge. Please don't score from this. Please don't score from this. Good save, Casper Schmeichel. Good save. Quite an easy save, to be honest, though. But nevertheless, it was a good save. Could have went through his legs, I guess. Right. They have a corner. What can they do with this? Can they do anything with this? No. 
Oh wait, they still got the ball. Now they can't do anything with it. But didn't manage to get it. Oh come on, Dak. Come on, Dak. Get to that. Cross that in, Dak. Come on, Ross Barkley. Oh, I thought I was in. I thought I was in. Unlucky Barkley. That must have been just wide. I want to have a look at this. Hopefully they'll show a replay. Let's have a look. Perfect replay for that. Oh, it was just wide. I thought that was in. The keeper would have had that, I reckon, as well. But um, they're making a substitution. I think I'll make a sub soon because Yanazai's stamina isn't really that good. So maybe I'll bring uh, Weston on for the game. But he's already had his debut. He's played pretty well. Um, pretty average for a left mid, as you'd expect. He hasn't got the best of finishing or anything like that. Um, so it's pretty difficult to score with him. But he's been pretty good. He's made a few challenges and stuff. So there's nothing else that you could really ask from him. Um, other than a goal. But, you know, like I said, he's got pretty poor finishing. So it's going to be difficult for that. Come on, Connor Wickham. Oh, he's out-muscled his opponent. Come on. Boom. Oh, great save. Great save. Is that Linganzi? Was that Linganzi? I think it was. Substitution. Thomas on, uh, on for Rob Robinson. Okay. They make they make a substitution. Hopefully, trying to get back into this game. Okay. Right. Can we do anything from this corner? Let's give uh, it to Yana's eye. Let's cross that in. That looks like a pretty good cross. It was. Oh, that's in. I thought that was wide. It's in. That's an own goal. It's an own goal. 2 0 to me. Even the goalkeeper's like, really? Really, man? 2 0. Fleck. A g on go, uh, an own, own goal from Fleck. I can't even say it. Yes, I am English. <laughs> Alright, so here's a couple of substitutions. I bought Lee on as well as Weston for Dak and Yanazai because Lee can play right mid and uh, Weston, Yanazai's stamina wasn't the best. So I wanted Weston to. Uh, to come on so it's been pretty good hopefully we can continue to do this um, and try and pick up this win we have got a corner so let's see what we can do from this corner Yanazai has been taken off so the corner take is not the best we've got Smith taking it um, but that seems to be the best corner take we have on the pitch in a minute so Connor Smith hits it in and Wickham just over the bar so sadly we couldn't get anything on it but um, still a 2-0 lead so it's not too bad oh that was a bad challenge from Lee that was a really late challenge from Lee. The yellow card, okay. That wasn't that bad. That was a really, really bad challenge. Look at this. He'd already passed the ball and he still goes in anyway. Oh, boots high as well. Maybe a red card. Not too sure. It was really dangerous. Lucky to get a yellow, I guess. But that was still a really bad challenge. Ross Barkley's off. Ross Barkley. Ross Barkley. Oh, just over the bar. Just over the bar. Maybe I should have either cut in, gone a little bit further on and cut in on my right. But either way, that's still a good opportunity for Ross Barkley. Damn. Oh, wow. Good challenge. That's a good challenge. All right, let's throw it back on, though. Hopefully Lee's still got this. He's managed to get around his man. He crosses that in. Is that good? That's ours anyway. Sars anyway. Okay. I'm okay with that. It's a pretty poor place to, to have it though. But we're just going to whip it in. Joe Martin whips it in. What a... That was good. That was a pretty good free kick. I must admit. It's pretty good. Can we get anything from this corner? Let's have a look. Smith crosses it in. Far post. Ah. It's another corner surely. Is that goal kick? They've given a goal kick by the looks of it. Ah. Alright. Oh, what a ball. He finds Lee. Lee whips that in. Can he find Wickham? Oh, Weston could have got to that as well. Weston's got pace to try and catch the ball up. He does manage to get it. He gets a touch on it. Can Ross Barkley pick it up? Come on, Wickham. Get this. Have one more opportunity. Now, it looks like it's going to blow. The Weffle's going to blow. Uh, the Weff. The Ref's going to blow for full time unless we can get that. Come on, Wickham. Wickham's just not fast enough. But there you go. Full-time whistle. 2-0 win against Coventry. Pretty comfortable, to be honest. They had a chance or two. Um, but a pretty comfortable victory, as you'd expect, because this team is just so strong. Um, but, yeah, 2-0 victory, another three points. Pretty goddamn good result.
Alright, so we've got a couple of emails here from one of them from San Lorenzo because I put in an inquiry for Angel Correa. Um, he's a very, very good player. Um, he starts off at 75 overall, I believe. Um, so he's a very, very good player. And he, his inquiry is apparently about £10 million, but I do not have that. So I'm thinking about putting in about three. Three point three million pounds, and hopefully try and get someone in with him. Um, who else? Danny Kedwell, maybe they probably won't accept that. Um, but he's only on seven hundred fifty uh, fifty thousand pound a week. Holy Christ, that's a lot. But yeah, he's not on much. So hopefully, we will see it, what they say. All right, so we have a couple of. Um, Office here. We have a couple of emails here. So Bakali has accepted his contract by the looks of it. Five-year contract worth fifteen thousand pounds a year. Uh, a year. Wow, that's not even that much. Fifteen thousand pounds a week, um, which is pretty good. And uh, Craig Fagan is going to go as well for three million pounds. And uh, Chris, uh, Craig Fagan for Bakali, who I think is a fantastic deal. So we're going to go ahead and accept that. There's also a loan offer and another accept offer. So Yed Vaj is going to be coming um, to Gillingham on loan as well for only £4,000 a week for um, a 17-year-old defender who is very, very good. And also DeAndre Yedlin. Now, you guys suggested this, and I don't know how good he is, but we're going to see how good he is. Um, we're going to go ahead and accept it. He only wants £4,000 a week anyway, so... Let's go have a look at all of these players. All right, guys. So here are the players. Here is DeAndre Yedlin. By the looks of it, he's a very, very quick right back. He's 66 overall. Um, he's got pretty good physical attributes. His strength isn't the best. His jumping isn't the best. Neither is reactions. But he's got amazing acceleration, amazing sprint speed, good agility, balance, and stamina as well, which is good. Um, a pretty average mental attributes. Pretty average uh, skill attributes as well. Um, some decent dribbling, some decent shot power, um, and everything else is pretty average. Three star skill, most three star weak foot. Twenty years old, high in attack, uh, high in medium work rate. So a high attacking work rate and medium defensive. I'm not too sure about that. We'll see how this works. Um, no traits. He's a speed start as a speciality, and yeah, so that's that's one of them. So let's have a look at Yedvaj. Yedvaj is. Um, also 66 overall. His speed stats aren't very good. His physical attributes are pretty bad, other than strength and reactions. But he's got good mental attributes. He's got pretty decent skill attributes for a defender. Good heading accuracy, good marking, good standing tackle, good sliding tackle. Um, and he's also 3-star weak foot, 2-star skill moves. He can play centre-back and right-back. Um, a medium and high attack... Uh, um, medium high work rates and uh, it seems pretty good so he's obviously on loan for a little bit so um, as you can see he will be a good player I think and uh, contribute quite a bit now let's have a look at Bacali Bacali is a 71 rated player already 87 acceleration 83 sprint speed 84 agility 92 balance um, pretty everything else is pretty average other than his strength his strength is pretty low um, he's got Average mental attributes apart from aggression and interceptions. Um, his dribbling is good. He's got good ball control. He's got decent free kick accuracy. Good short passing. Um, decent shot power and long shots. And um, he's also got good uh, volleys, curves and penalties. He's okay as well. So he's pretty decent. Four star weak foot, four star skill means he can play on the right or left. Um, and he's 17 overall. At high and medium work rates. He's got flair and long shot taker as well as his traits, and he's a dribbler, uh, dribbler as well. So it's pretty good. Um, so yeah, there's nothing else to say. In the next game, in the next episode, we will see uh, us play Torquay in the uh, J Paint Trophy. So hopefully you guys have enjoyed this episode. As always, thanks for watching, and I will see you next time. Later's.